welcome back to my channel in this video we are going to find the equation of motion of a spring mass system by using Lagrangian method we know that spring mass system is an example of a linear harmonic oscillator in order to solve the spring mass system problem we are going to consider the ideal spring mass system which consists of a massless spring one of its end is connected to a mass M and the other end is connected to a rigid support. Suppose we are going to consider the ideal situation. In this case, a spring of ma a massless spring is connected to a mass M. A mass M. The spring is ma massless and it is connected to a mass M and the other end is connected to a rigid support. For simplicity, we are considering the ideal system. So, one end of the spring is connected to MRSM and the other end is connected to uh, a rigid support. Also, for the ideal, ideal case, we are going to consider that the mass is going to move over a frictionless surface. And the surface over which the mass moves is considered to be frictionless. This is the uh, pictorial representation of a spring mass system for the ideal case. Ideal case, a massless spring attached to a spring, uh, sorry, a mass of a mass M and the other end is connected to a rigid support. Also, the surface over which the mass moves is frictionless. So, if we apply a force on the mass to stretch or compress the spring and then release the force, the motion of the system is simple harmonic. If x is the displacement suppose x is the displacement of the mass at any instant then the restoring force exerted by the spring on mass m suppose we are going to apply a force on the spring uh, in order to stretch and compress we can apply the force on two ways we can structure the spring also we can compress the spring so if we apply a force in order to make a displacement x of the mass at any instant T, then the restoring force, the force opposing the applied force developed inside the spring can be written as F equal to restoring force F equal to minus Kx because the restoring force is equal and opposite to the applied force uh, and K is the force constant and K is the force constant. In this case, we are going to find the equation of motion of the spring mass system. If F is the force, then the potential energy of the system at this displacement X is given by potential energy V equal to negative integral of F dx. Force integral of force is potential. We know that force is negative gradient of potential. So, V equal to minus integral F dx. We can take the limit from 0 to x. So, V equal to minus integral 0 to x. F dx. We can substitute the value of F here. So, it is minus integral 0 to x minus kx dx. It is equal to half kx square. Now, the kinetic energy of the system. The system is moving. The mass M is moving. So, there will be some kinetic energy. So, kinetic energy of the system T equal to half M into V square. But we know that V velocity is X dot. So, it is equal to half M X dot square. Now, we can form the Lagrangian using the famous equation L equal to T minus V that is equal to half mx dot square minus half kx square. This is the Lagrangian of the system. Now we can use the, we have found the Lagrangian of the system. Now we can use the Lagrangian to calculate the or to find the equation of motion. We have the Lagrange's equation as the Lagrange's equation is d by dt of dou L by dou x dot d by dt of dou L by dou x dot minus 
tau n by tau x equal to 0. Now we can substitute the value of L that is L equal to T minus V equal to half mx dot square minus half kx square. So from this equation dou L by dou x dot equal to mx dot dou L by dou x equal to kx. So d by dt of dou L by dou x dot mx dot minus kx equal to 0 or m is a constant so we can write it as mx double dot minus kx equal to 0. Sorry here it is minus kx so it is plus kx plus kx equal to mx double dot plus kx equal to 0 or rearranging we get x double dot plus k by m x equal to 0. So this is the required equation of motion of the spring mass system. It represents a simple harmonic motion. Uh, simple it represents a simple harmonic motion. This is similar to the expression x double dot plus omega square x equal to 0 where omega is the angular frequency and is given by comparing these two equations we can write omega equal to root k by m. We know that omega is related to frequency by 2 pi nu or it is related to the time period by 2 pi by t. Nu is 1 by t. So omega is related to time period by 2 pi by t or we can write time period t equal to 2 pi by omega. So from this equation omega equal to root k by m. So here we get t equal to 2 pi by 2 pi by omega. So it is equal to 2 pi omega is root k by m. So 1 by omega is root m by k. So this is the equation for the time period of our spring mass system. It executes simple harmonic motion and its time period is given by 2 pi by omega equal to 2 pi root m by k. So thank you for watching this video.